Hello, I'm Nat Ives, and this is 3-Minute Adage. ABC sales chief Mike Shaw hasn't gotten over an earlier defeat in the Live Plus 7 commercial ratings debate. In the haggling that resulted in the 2007 adoption of TV's new commercial rating system, Live Plus 3, or C3, won out. So three days' worth of DVR time-shifted viewers are now included in the Nielsen ratings that drive the TV ad business. At the annual Television Week Ad Age Upfront Advertising Summit last week, Mr. Shaw continued to hammer away for a much longer time-shifted period. I think we need C14. Uh, <laughs> uh, I don't know, at least C7. Um, it, to, to me, the creative isn't being switched out enough, guys. If it's my favorite show and it runs on Monday night and I travel and I come home and watch it Friday night, it doesn't count. But if I might cut my trip short and come home Thursday night and watch it, it does count. Uh, that's silly. If the creative hasn't gone out of rotation and it's not a sale end date and the movie hasn't opened and you can count up there, because we went back and looked at the creative that were given, and we got stuff running for months, let alone the week or the extra four days we're talking about here. C3 was certainly a step forward. It, it reminds me though, uh, earlier what we were talking about with the DVR, because the DVR and the use of the DVR actually cuts both ways. The homes with DVRs watch a lot more television. The highest ratings of my top 10 shows are in DVR homes, not non-DVR homes. It's almost 70% of everything recorded in prime time is going to the networks. It's clearly a real network issue and specific program issues to others. Um, but the fact that 50% are about that are watching the commercials I thought was actually kind of good news when I first heard it. Um, but it's also leading to some other metrics because it's really a very interesting metric that nobody's talking about. And that's on a 100 unit basis, the percentage of commercial seen. Because the, one of the things the DVR does for us, it allows that number to be a lot higher. Let me explain that real briefly. ABC and primetime does about a 95 or 94 index in, in our average primetime show. So on a live viewing basis to commercial. So five, six percent of the people on each commercial break on average go somewhere else, gray somewhere else, what have you. When I add back the DVR viewing, I get back to 100, I get back to 101. Most cable index is around 91. And none of the shows are in essence being DVR'd on average across those 120 channels. You stay at 91. So over every 100 units you buy on ABC, 100 units are seen. Every 100 units you buy on cable, 91 are seen. Nobody thinks about that. And that's it for this three-minute adage. Thanks for being with us. I'm Nat Ives at Advertising Age in New York.